Hey, this is Lawrence Kane Jr., author of Money Sees 30 Financial Principles, and you're watching Profiles on the Cincinnati Herald. Sure, the title of the book is Money Seeds 30 Financial Principles. Uh, the purpose of the book is to give people clarity and direction when it comes to their finances. So uh, when you look at uh, the book, it's 30 Financial Principles, um, and then after each principle, there's questions. So uh, they give people just a better understanding of their financial situation, you know, from you know what their credit score is like to you know who do they talk to with their finances under 50 pages so like you said a very short read and so after you get through the 30 principles uh, in the back there's budgeting principles uh, there's investment jargon and then there's uh, for those who have kids or plan to have kids uh, there's a financial independent checklist uh, that you can go through where where anybody who has a kid we, they can't move out the house until they complete that checklist. Mm -hmm. I think the hardest principle would be uh, judge each day not by its harvest, but by the seed you sow into it. Um, and the reason why it was hard for me is because I grew up just wanting everything <laughs> without really working for it. I mean, just be honest. But, and uh, when it comes to building a business, when it comes to getting uh, ahead financially, uh, you have to you have to focus on so and see. So when you get that big contract, that's not the time to let off. You know the the gas. That's the time to really analyze and see what the next move is. You know when you get that promotion, that's not the time to lax. When you get the new job, that's not the time uh, to you know just enjoy the harvest. Why it, it's good to you know be appreciative of it. You have to sow seeds, it's, it's, and you can't let a day be wasted uh, just because you don't feel like it. <laughs> Uh, it's geared towards, um, I would say, the younger millennials. So anybody between 18 and 30, um, the, that would be ideal um, for for them to read. Really get get cleared. I mean, but it's people that are 45 that that have bought the book and really you know enjoy it. Um, but I think it's for everybody. Um, and if you don't feel like you need this book, then buy it for somebody who you do. I mean, this information out to. Uh, the younger generation, but also us, man. I mean, we don't have to uh, just sacrifice so much um, where we don't reap the, the benefits of our life. We can enjoy life, um, but we also need to set the, the stage and set the level for our, our next generation. Money Talks, um, and I first started with doing videos on Facebook uh, two years ago called Money Mondays, so it kind of evolved into uh, of course, you know, looking at what the market is, looking at what people, how people are digesting um, information, I decided to go with the podcast. And uh, what we do on there is just give a history lesson, if you will, on uh, certain topics. You know, our first episode was about student loans. So we did the history about student loans. And um, I found out on there that the first person to offer a student loan was Harvard. It's a bi-weekly uh, podcast, so we, we have new episodes every two weeks. And... Uh, we just we just really want to give people that extra information that they're not telling us um, and and that's just another platform that we use Definitely. Uh, so I'm on all social media um, Facebook Lawrence Kane uh, Instagram Lawrence Kane jr. Uh, snapchat Lawrence Kane jr. Twitter Lawrence Kane jr. you can also follow our business abundance University on Facebook Instagram Twitter it's abundance u 513 um, you can go to our website abundanceuniversity.net so find the book on our website again we have it for ebook audiobook and paperback um, and again with it being a short read it's a great investment